finished working on the video now i'm actually heading out i'm going to see my friends but finally done with this week like tomorrow like i'm really excited because i've missed my hair and the weather is just getting hotter and hotter which is really weird because this is december and we're supposed to like we're expecting dry weather cool weather lagos here we're still waiting for the hammer time i'm using a new hairstylist tomorrow like if you know me really well you know that i get paranoid when it comes to, like hair and makeup i like it to be people that i really really trust and when i end up trying like new people and they just amaze me i'm always very happy so trying this new person tomorrow gonna let you guys know how it goes i want to close my blind you guys um i'm at a restaurant now i'm about to eat dinner okay normally i'll just go home i was with my friend for like a very long time but the problem is traffic is so bad traffic is so freaking bad that i don't even want to sit in it so i'm like instead of just sitting in traffic and getting angry you know let me just find somewhere to eat dinner and then at least if i'm sitting in traffic i'm sitting in traffic with a full stomach Noma is on the phone i feel like if i'm not with Noma physically i take her everywhere okay she's on the phone oh, here yeah. <laughs> and she's asking me what the name of that angeli angelina song is Noma, how many times did i tell the name of that song the name of the song is on the low. By the way, guys, if you guys have not seen, <laughs> guys, if you've not seen Bona Boys on the low video, you guys should go check it out. I'm a Casper and Gambini's in case you're wondering. <laughs> Guys, Google Maps is telling me 51 minutes to my house. This is the reason why I stopped here to eat. I was hoping that by the time I was done, the traffic would have cleared, but then the road is still as red as ever. There's nothing I hate like sitting in traffic. On a normal day, VI to my house is about 30 minutes. 30, 25, 20 minutes. It's like an hour right now. Good morning. So, I'm on my way to the salon. I told you guys yesterday that I am cutting my hair again today. Not cutting, just like touching up my roots with relaxer. Whenever I say cutting, yeah, it's a cut. And Google Maps is saying that traffic is not bad, so I am happy about that. Well, I'll show you guys the space once I get there. got here my extensions look at the cute gold chairs <laughs> the details man the details got to be for got to be lovers like me they also have really like gorgeous like gorgeous like wigs these wigs are laid to the gods I wish you guys could see just how amazing this section is. Hold on. That's can you do walking around? I love plants and I love these chairs. This is the mani section. So this is where you get your manicure done. Yeah. This is the mani section. Yes. Okay. This right here, we're not done yet. It's supposed to be the bar area. So we're going to have like a happy hour. <laughs> Are you guys hearing? Okay. You drink. Okay. <laughs> While you get yourself pampered. This is the petty section. Everything is all rustic and kinde ish. <laughs> Literally, that's the only word that I would use. Kinde is actually a word to describe a vibe right now because that is what this place is. So, this sure. section is also really cute. Oh, um, guys, this place is so beautiful. Yeah, this is a station. And then that's the makeup yeah, bit that's there. The makeup area. Oh my god, guys. So of course, I'm, I'm like a perfectionist, so yeah. everything is not done. Yeah. Yet. 
Yeah, no, but this, like, you guys should just imagine how this place is going to be once, like, they launch, because this place looks amazing already. This is the waiting area here, fam. Is this your regular waiting area? Just want to ask you guys. <laughs> this looks like a proper sitting room, Kende. <laughs> Honestly, look at. So there I are throws and pillows <laughs> and what's not. We're going to have a PlayStation here. We're Can you imagine? Here. So the guys, so that the guys can... Wait, yeah. Wait, and you don't have to disturb the girls and giving them attitudes. Oh my so god! The guys so they I'm so chill. freaking proud of Kane. That you guys don't even know. <laughs> like this place is amazing. <laughs> so freaking gorgeous. This part is so important, guys. This is between push home. Okay. Key, major, major key. <laughs> I'm about to um, get a pedicure now. This was so relaxing, I forgot to show it at all. My nails are done and they look gorgeous. Ooh. Good morning, it's me and my hair again. So it's Saturday morning and I'm actually heading out of the house. It's 9.30 a.m. right now. So I'm on my way to Insha. I'm not gonna tell you guys till I get into a car. So this is me and Stephanie. Hey, hi guys. <laughs> <laughs> Stephanie and you guys saw in the last vlog. So we're going for a swimming class. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing? <laughs> we're going for a swimming class. See, I've told myself that. I have to start doing all these things because there are classes every day here in Lagos, cooking classes, this classes like this is a sewing class, it's a new experience, go and learn something. So we're going to start with sewing and I'm going with Stephanie today. I don't know why I keep laughing every time I say, I cannot sew handkerchief. Handkerchief. She said this, I actually she know how to sew. I know how to sew and I know see, how to make it. I will see you guys later. <laughs> <laughs> if I wasn't doing makeup, I think that I'm so into interior design. Like I love oh, when yeah, it's yeah, yeah, you good. Are. Yeah. I love it when the space is good and I love putting spaces together. So I feel like maybe if this like your sister said, you have OCD. <laughs> <laughs> if I wake up in the morning and I want today to go well, first of all, just your day. Put everything are out, then serious? I can start thinking. Yeah. It is routine like that for me. Oh. And I I so how I do it, like when I wake up in the morning, mm -hmm. I block Beep. everything out. Oh. Yeah. I wish so it was that easy for me. <laughs> so I can't see anything that's happening around me. Do you know, uh, I'm the, I'm the, like, like these days I've been so busy and like sometimes if I just come back from anything, I'm so exhausted, I just want to sleep. And that was never me. I remember when I came back, I went for my brother's graduation two weeks ago and I was, so that trip was three days. We literally left Nigeria in the morning, came back. Just call it two days later, self. Like so, just three days. So we were trying to jam so much Together. into that trip. And one thing that I remember was I came back. No more me. I could do the most stressful things. Go to the most stressful places. Come back. I cannot sleep. Like I can't do anything Until unless I unpack. Said, unpack the things I came back with. You're joking. I'm not joking. I don't pack till like five weeks. See, <laughs> I, I know. Like Months later. I remember somebody I said, don't unpack. Somebody rather. said on Twitter. I read on Twitter that if you're one of those people that unpack immediately after your trip, you're a serial killer. <laughs> For me to sleep, I have to open that box, oh put days. everything where it has to oh be, and days. close the box. Oh my and days. then I remember that that day I was so tired that I just came, I just dumped everything, everything and I went to Canada and I was like, nah, chilling my you're really, really, really tired. You're really tired. You're really tired. Because, <laughs> hey, no, me. You're really I don't tired. Know. And I feel like for me, it's just like a mental thing of no, if I put all these things, then my enjoyment will be complete. <laughs> or my rest will be complete. If I don't do it when I feel like I have to do, do it, it and forget about it, I can't. Re like I'm resting, else. not that I can't do anything else. Like I'm resting, but it's still at the back of my mind, mind. that I have not unpacked and I don't want it there. Yeah. So I get rid of. Oh god! I the only thing that happens to me is clean, like 
clean places. Mm. You like I can it come, when the place is clean. I like it when the place is clean, but I don't mind it scattered. Yeah. I have a friend like that as well. She said that no, she she it she wants it to be it has to be clean, but then she, it doesn't have to be tidy. It doesn't like, have to be tidy. It yeah. has to be clean, but it doesn't have to be tidy. Some people actually prefer it like with clutter, like like you, yeah. you are. I remember like if some people prefer homes not looking perfect, they prefer it with clutter because that shows to them that it's lived in, that a human yeah. being lives yeah. here. My living room has to be arranged, but like my room where I spend most of What is wrong with this best thing? Oh if you day. scratch my car, are you okay? Ah. See his car self. Oh my dear. <laughs> 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 Okay. Oh, Sorry. So much. <laughs> Before you put me in trouble. Hey, don't mind her. <laughs> Lagos people drive like mad people here. Yeah, you guys just know that. We're here, guys. She means a stitch that joins two or more pieces of to fabric together. That is a seam. After this class, <laughs> you will not see the joint joint on the other end. determines its function. My seam. The kimono. So it's kimono because it is cut as one piece of the body. So just here. Yeah? And it is wide. Yeah. You also said that if you check on the edge, it's okay. right between two. This is what we're going to be making a sheet dress Keep on, just keep on, keep on, keep on. Stop. Or huh. if your heart is strong, like my heart is strong, when you get to the end, you reverse. reverse. <laughs> Dima is now a tailor, guys. My dear. Tailor Dima. Fabrics. One top, 100k. <laughs> she said it's one top, 100k. Who will pay? <laughs> guys, we just got to cactus. We're here to eat. And <laughs> look who I'm with. I mean, Elita, it's her birthday today. <laughs> Happy birthday. Thank you. <laughs> she looks so gorgeous. Thank you. We're going to check to see if there's space in here because this place is normally packed during the weekends. The last time I was here was. Um, 2013 but then Stephanie saying that they've renovated and everything has changed has changed so let's uh no let's do it here I hope they won't say that this place is reserved is this reserved? no thank you and this place has changed so much like this place has changed so much last time I was here like I know that they do good food but it didn't look this nice Steph got um, a burger with fries and salad. This is a fried chicken burger. Um, yam fries with pepper sauce or tomato sauce, like stew. Um, I got a tuna sandwich. Merry okay. Christmas. Merry Christmas, guys. It's the 25th and I'm just leaving the house actually. It's around 6 p.m. I've just been sleeping all day, but I'm going to be out probably all night. So I'm meeting up with Yuki. First, you guys know who Yuki is. She's in Lagos. Like all my faves are in Lagos right now. Jackie is also here. I'm meeting Jackie tomorrow. After that, I'm going somewhere else. So I'm going to take you guys along and try to vlog as strategically as I can. Hello. Oh, okay. <laughs> Look who's here. Yes, so. <laughs> 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 
Say hi. Angela. Angela, Angela say hi. Oh my this god, my I, can't, I can't believe this is happening. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I'm so used to this life, I can't believe it. And you keep like you're not doing anything for fans. Fans want to meet you. I what did I tell you? They've her? been going on and on in my demon. Dimma, you kiss here. Dimma, Jackie and I is here. We command you. Do something and I'm like <laughs> you guys should have planned this better. Honestly. Well, and I didn't know you were coming. Like I knew that Jackie was coming because Jackie told me like two weeks ago that she was coming. Oh. If I knew you were coming, like you guys uh, are kind of coordinated. Yeah, yes. I'm here. What's this place called again? It's called Warehouse. Warehouse with Miles. We're trying to take a mirror selfie. Yes, which I'm very bad at. By the way, <laughs> <laughs> we're actually here to get merch for Bonner Boy. Bonner Boy is having merch today. He show is tomorrow. Yeah. 26th, and that's what everybody's talking about, you know? It's going to be the maddest show of the <laughs> 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 Go back to Enugu because of this show. He's on my mouse. Me, I'm leaving my house here. Friday, village. They lie, they lie, they lie. <laughs> <laughs> We're going Thank for you, the. Everyone. Yeah. Uh, okay, so, can you do? Hi, guys. Ketan. Hello. Oh my god, it's all like a mess. She just was yeah, Oh my god. god. <laughs> we are. Heading out. To? <laughs> <laughs> it's the all black party. I went for this last year. You guys saw. Yes. It's Kita. We went. We went. It was me, Kenya, and Dima. <laughs> I'm so freaking tired, it's like past 12. I go home around 5 a.m. You guys told me when I was leaving the house yesterday, I was like, I'm meeting Yuki today, and then tomorrow I'm meeting Jackie, blah, blah, blah. Guys, I ended up meeting like almost everybody that I wanted to meet up with yesterday. I had so much fun, like just so many gorgeous people in one space. Made me really happy. So, I'm going out today again. Jackie's doing a brunch. We're gonna go for that. I'm going to eat. I almost said breakfast. I'm going to just eat because it's past 12. And yeah, start getting ready. Zima, you are telling Stella that she's not her brother. 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 She's not her br
left rice and copper. We are going to Crab Gourmet now to eat. So, um, Ezzy Nick got burgers, she's sharing with Chi. Uh, Nikki got uh, a burger as well. Um, Stag is eating pasta, <laughs> carbonara. Yeah. Um, and she's not sharing. I think she got ordered chicken and waffles, right? Yeah. Let me see. So far, let's see. Your suggestion has been A1. So far. Oh, wow. Thank you. Thank you very much. Highly raved about this restaurant. Yeah. Yeah. I'm very cheeky. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, let me see your shrimp though. Let me see. Did you clear the plate? Really good. Hey. There's a little kick to it. Mm. Yeah. Try it. Yeah. Mm. Yes. It's very good. Mm. Heavily. Okay. Empty. I'm gonna be the the. Um, <laughs> let's see. Yeah. Anybody? You guys? Do you like it? There's a kick to it, but then it's not. It's not hot. <laughs> yeah. No, I'm joking. <laughs> Hello guys, the light is literally on top of me now. Let me move. I think it's a lot better now. Is it better now? Let me find the lighting. Oh god. Um, okay, this is good. Okay, guys, I'm gonna end this vlog. I just got home and I am so freaking tired that we left dinner around like 8 39. Guys, I was in traffic for about four hours between phase one and where I live. I like this is like on a normal day, it's 10 minutes. I was there for like Four freaking hours there's this nice club that they opened somewhere opposite to Orlando and the government needs to kind of move that in because I don't understand like they were doing this thing and like people were literally like sometimes when you sit in traffic like this I really wonder and just worry about people who have emergencies and who might have like serious issues and they're stuck in traffic it's around 2 a.m. now and like I got home First of all, I started packing. I'm going back to Enugu tomorrow. Going back to the village. I'm almost done with my packing, Sha. I have so much to do this night before I go to bed. Because I want to have this up and then just take tomorrow to rest. I cannot wait to go home because it's my grandma's 70th. And all my cousins are back from Canada, the States. Like, people I have never even seen before. I'm so happy. I'm so excited. So I get to see them. I'm going to leave details for all the places that I went to in the description box, like all the nice places that I showed in this vlog. Um, Nedu Swing Club slash class, I really, really loved that class. Like you guys saw that I made an entire outfit from scratch. I was even laughing at myself in the beginning because I did not think that I could do it, but then I did it. She breaks things down so well and just, just makes teaching look fun. Honestly, because we laughed a lot in that class and then we learned stuff. So I'm going to leave details in the description box. Check out if you're looking to learn how to sew um, as a beginner or if you just need to, I guess, learn how to just perfect things. That would be a good place to check out. My extensions was amazing. You guys saw. That place was absolutely stunning. And I got the best haircut from there loved it what else did i want to say to you guys before i ended this okay yeah i know that i get a lot of questions about how i retain my curls i've been getting this a lot on instagram especially after i started posting pictures of me with my hair again because i was wearing wigs for a while but people have just been asking me how do you like retain your curls so what i do normally is i always have this like it's a satin bonnet satin wrap let me open it up so that you guys can see Mm, guys, I sprained my left wrist. I can't even believe that I'm holding this camera with it. Like, I'm trying to keep my hands steady. Every time I move my thumb, it hurts for some weird reason. Hopefully, it stops soon. So, I have these. You guys see me tying this on my head all the time. And basically, it protects my hair. So, what I normally do when I come back is... Um, so, what I do when I come back is I, um, you know, take my makeup off, shower and all of that. And then I use this. You guys have seen me talking about this a lot on my channel and on Instagram as well. This is the Mega Growth Leave-In Conditioner. So, you guys have seen that I've used it quite a lot. I don't use too much for what I'm about to explain to you guys, but just very little. Hold on, let me show you guys the amount. 
about this much so you guys can see that i don't have a lot on my finger so what i do is I, I work i spread this on my palms evenly and i just dab my hair like this so my my palms are coated and i just dab and this just hydrates okay keeps my hair moisturized so that when you sleep your hair doesn't break or cut out all those things and another thing again that i do is when it comes to hair i tend to treat hair care products the way that i treat skincare products so if a brand works for me i stick to it the this is a product that they released this year sometime this year and i've talked about this on instagram as well you guys have seen that i have used quite a bit so i also take very little this i only apply on my edges i know that some people like like to seal moisture with oils like this i honestly don't like doing that because i don't want anything that will weigh my hair down but i just take a little bit of this oil on my edges and then i use this to wrap my hair the way that i wrap my hair i just tie it at the back but then i make sure that the thing like it covers my face up to here. I don't want the edge of the wrap sitting on my edges. I take my edges seriously, guys. So that's it. I have to sleep so that I can wake up really early. My flight is by 7.30. I'm so glad that I met all the amazing people that I met in this vlog. People that I only see once every year. Like Jackie, I haven't even seen Jackie in like four or five years. I'm glad that I saw her again. I'm just glad that I got to just spend my Christmas and the last few days like with these people. So I hope you guys enjoy this one. I'll see you in my next one. Mm.